I've been fighting with this thing all day. It's December 21st, and Tia Slosser and this sewing machine are not getting along. I don't think I'm a seamstress. I don't think I should, I don't think I should pursue that. Luckily, she has plenty to fall back on. I'm always just kind of out trying to find what I like to do best. Usually that's some kind of visual art, usually involving cats. I'm a big cat fan. I couldn't tell. <laughs> but not always. After needing a break from sewing during Central's 24 hours of art, Slosser sat down to work on this intricate, past its prime, strawberry. It's rotting fruit, which I think it's just something like there's so many different textures and colors and nobody else really pays attention to that, but I just think that type of thing's really cool. Art teacher Carrie Adams can spot a Slosser a mile away. Gotta have a little quirkiness to it. There is serious work, but on average, I think the, the free, uh, just free-spirited stuff. Slosser says she's eaten lunch in the art room every day but one in high school. She's helped make it a special place. We call ourselves down here sometimes the land of misfit toys. I've already seen her like mold, you know, not mold, but even just be a great role model for a lot of the freshmen. And not just here. Slosser has only taken one art class all of high school, believe it or not, to leave room for other things like film. I kind of call myself almost like a team mom. I just kind of make sure everybody's good, everybody has what they need, everybody's on script, everybody's on time. She works mostly behind the scenes, but flexes her acting chops in speech and drama. Slosser has won state titles in humorous duo and dramatic duo the last two years. I just love speech and debate so much. Uh, this year I'm hoping to double enter into like a dramatic solo event. So which of these talents is she choosing for a career? None of them. Slosser plans to go to medical school, but when that gets tough, she'll know just where to turn. It's almost like a sort of de-stressor for me. It's something to take my mind off of, uh, you know, school uh, and just like more serious stuff. If this is, you know, something that she can lean back on instead of getting into those negative vices that are out there in the world that people do, let this be your addiction. As long as it's not sewing. I may just go back to painting because I can't really mess that one up as badly. <laughs> In Billings, Casey Conlon, MTN News.